Hey folks, welcome back to Ostrov. Well, that was quite a jumpy horse, but they, they figured out how to use our new carriage passes in there. Kind of nice to see. Everyone's just walking through it. And we've got another row house about to complete. Got five guys working on it right now. It's August, so a lot of the uh, crews are, are uh, laid off in order to uh, continue working with the harvest, which I think we are getting close to being done. That one's mostly done. That one's done. There's one more that we've started over here. Gotta wait for all this to end before I can set these guys. Otherwise, four big fields. Lots of people available. Should be no problem. We're still in August, so we should get all that out easily before frost. What is happening with our hops farm? All right, hop yard, one worker going to work, harvesting. Okay, so harvesting happened in the middle of August. Interesting. Okay, so I guess August we do want to set for, for I'm guessing, five. I need to watch and see what what this means. Is it If it goes kind of like the orchard, then two people ought to be enough to do it. But you are just going to work, so we'll just wait and see what you do. I'm curious if you can do anything on your own. Let's speed this up and see what your initial process is, and then we'll bring more people in. But I'm curious to see uh, how this works. So you're heading in. Now from the orchards, they just stand inside. But he's actually going to walk out and start the process of... Filling up a bushel basket? Yep, the plants go away. Wonderful. Okay, well that is hops. Six, seven, eight. Eight or nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten? Anyway, forty. Must have been... Hmm, okay. Well, it works. So let's do three. Three on, one off. And we'll see just what that means. So on, last time was March. Let's, we'll, we'll give it a three month run just in case this takes longer than I think. And I guess nobody is needed otherwise. So I guess you set, you set to zero. Okay. Well, we'll let that one go. You are ready to mow down some grass. And where are you actually heading? You are going to here. Let's watch this process. Meanwhile, we're taking more hops down in the background. So she just starts mounding up grass on the ground. It grows. <laughs> and she puts it away. One time only. Supplying resources. One time only. Interesting. Do they really make this trip out here for one little mound of grass? I wonder. Okay, so waiting for someone else to be available to go help this person out. And at that, I think we will initiate two hops farms. Move you in. And so we're waiting for this guy to finish. I set a stone well. We have that stone well there. I set gazebos in the schools. I get to thinking that kind of looks like a... Oh, uh... Let's see, where is one? It's over here. This guy might work as outdoor play equipment. <laughs> Closest thing I've got. Um, so, I set, I think, four of those around. One back over, a couple back over there. And we have some village houses that are all ready to start building. Where are you? There, 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 and there. Good. Still cleaning out trees from these. Um... Let's check in on our tavern. Made 240 last month, but yeah, wealth is just continually dropping. I don't think they're going to pull it off. I don't think the, the tavern there is going to work. And I wonder if it would do any better right here. I wonder if it is a distance thing. If this would be a little more easier to grab people with that need to have them come over here. I don't know. So let's just do that and see if it helps. Spin you around. 
How best? I didn't want it next to the school, but that's the, the real estate we have left. Um, uneven terrain. So we cannot... Uh, wow. We really... Oh, there was one spot right there. You'll only do that. Hmm. Well, it kind of looks like a house, to tell you the truth. So we could do something like that, and I think it wouldn't be too big of a deal. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll play with the fencing later. But let's see if we can even get that done this episode, just to, uh, just to see what happens. All right, so that's going on there. I wandered through this place after last episode, and I planted probably hundreds of trees. So we should slowly start to uh, see that happen. A suggestion came in many episodes ago, and it was a good one, but I just never got around to it. To kind of break up the spruce forest was a, with a bunch of birch trees, so we can get some patches of other trees into the forest, which would look a lot more natural. So I think there's a patch over there, some over here. Might be some more in here somewhere. Um, threw a patch of it in places like this. Where was that? Right there. And through this forest, and through this forest, and that forest, and several places around town. So. They're going to pop in and surprise us because they will be in places that I have forgotten all about. <laughs> Over in here, seems like there were some here somewhere. Um, no. Wait a minute, I just saw something. No, that's, yeah, there. So some are in here. They kind of scatter around in this area. So it'll be easier to see them later. How are the pigs doing now? We're down to potatoes and beetroot and a little bit of wheat. And beetroot, there were a lot of them a while back. And this was the end of the season, right? Beet is gone. Okay, so that's no longer a thing, but we're... So October, we'll get a fresh batch of these. Still have... I think we're at the end of our potatoes, too. So we're in August, and potatoes should be harvesting. So, looking around, there's 2,100. Okay. So, they're probably the primary pig food, I would think. Well, there's a lot of clip clop clip clops They're everywhere. Speaking of them, how... So, we've got very little charcoal going now. Char uh, firewood, 7,200. 8,200. 6,500. And I decided to fire these guys back up again. We did get these planted and these trees taken out, but these guys have got a lot of red X's assigned. And they're not going to be able to do anything else until this is done. But there are other places that I would like to get trees removed. So I got to thinking, let's just let these guys go through and clean out things. The roads that's going to go along these houses over here and and some of the the trees that are still on the roads and other places and along there and behind these kind of clean it up a little bit so we'll leave a crew over here and just let them wander the map there's a pair of them right now going off with their their little axes in their hands and i go bang on a tree someplace in fact where are you guys going show path you're firing across <clears throat> to start cleaning up behind all these houses here so that will still maintain at least a little bit Let's let's just primarily make you guys firewood. Though some bark over here would be good. Why, right? We're using bark somewhere. The ash. Ash, ash, ash. That's here. Uses bark. Yeah. So bark over here and firewood. Lumber eventually gets trucked in to here. We have 5,000 out of 7,000. So for projects around here, there's some wood in place but eh, I'll go ahead and keep these guys going if just for this right here and to let them do all the little spot cleanups so I think that's gonna work out fine what else is going on we are finishing August how did you guys do one field left 
and still a whole bunch of folks working it. We've got one field left over here and a bunch of folks working it. We are pretty much done here. We're just hauling in the, uh, the, uh, the bundles. Great. And we're mostly done over here. So we've got, I'm going to say, four working farms. More birch trees. Birch trees. Birch trees. <laughs> yeah. We're going to change the landscape a little bit here. So, yep, yeah, let's get a second one going. You've been going at this for two weeks pretty much by yourself. And there's one guy here and one guy on a break. So two weeks, a month, six weeks. So two of them could easily do it by the end of September. We've got 200 so far. 300. So 600. There's probably 800 in here. What does that mean over here? Do we know? Is this one? Brewery. Okay, a batch of 500. I'm not seeing numbers in there. Hmm. So I'm not seeing 500, you know, 2 to 1 barley or anything like that. Your wheat, you were barley. Yeah. So when this one's done and everything rotates through, then I'll delete the, the fallow that was missed over here. I think it's this one. And reset that. Okay, so we may or we may not get beer this time. I don't know. don't know what quantities we're talking about, but 800 does not seem like an excessive amount. There was concern that these made ridiculous amounts of hops, but maybe that has been changed. And there was concern that one person couldn't work it alone. And we've, we've seen one person plant, and now we've seen one person um, uh, harvest. So these can be run by one person. So... All of the issues from long ago apparently have been worked out, and Hops is working great now. We have a boat. We had a boat. You left us something. You left us lime. Okay. And more clip-clop, clip-clops. Yeah, that is kind of a, of a neat sound rolling through town. I wonder if there's a reason to get a third one. What do we have here? That's not this one, but I do see hay. Good. At least some in there. Over here we have one. You are four years old. Three years old. Hmm. So that's six wagons in town so far. And they are set at the 50% mark we have horse need new shoes ah so we're awaiting shoes okay you you where am I there don't have that warning here we do have 12 shoes over here you have four shoes because I figure I'll replace one horse at a time so I would never need more than four you're supposed to have supposed to have 12 so somebody just didn't go and get them uh -huh. <laughs> Is that your fault? No. So, supplying resources. That's you. You're probably out there with a wagon. You're with a wagon. And one of these two is walking back with a bunch of shoes. Yeah. You are. Mm-hmm. It was all your fault. So, that's this guy right here. He works at the wagon shed, and he's coming over here to get shoes. And we've got 18 shoes. Okay. So in that case, I probably should allow them to stockpile more than they actually need so that there's some reserve. So 12 becomes 18. Uh, horseshoes, yeah. And you, same thing. Or can I just... There's no difference between the two. So apply to all. Okay. And what did I just apply? 1,000 water, 500 hay, 18 horseshoes, and 3 tack. Let's do 6 tack. Apply to all. Okay. So that cleans that up. And speaking of cleaning up, I went through and put little fences in here and there. That was interesting. She went all the way to there to turn this way. Oh, we definitely have some pathing issues here. <laughs> Trying to get a nice line that goes up the middle. 
Yeah, that's never easy. Um, close these off a little bit to force them toward the center some. I notice all their pathing always hits to a fence and then cracks. So I started putting little fences in here and there trying to defeat that. Same thing here. They hit, well, in this case, they just hit to the corner. So I kicked the corner out a little bit. More trees. And put fences around different places trying to shape pathways to try to get something that runs up the middle here. I'll probably never accomplish it, but it'd be great to have one solid path right to the end and then jogs out toward that bridge. But I might be... Uh, fighting against the current here though we do have some grass moving back in over here so that's that's kind of getting there yeah uh, you could probably go away now yeah I think so you can demolish and you drop into into this mess here somewhere okay um, who are you and no you're the you were here at the end of last episode and we didn't have any need for you okay so you're done. Let's speed things up. Get things moving. Um, harvest is looking great. Finishing up over here. And she got it finished. And then she picks up another stack instead. Hmm. <laughs> okay, cows. We are still waiting till the end of November to bring cows over here. I have all of our supplies, though. You guys do almost 300 to 500 500 hay though hay 50 okay uh, row house and have married okay there's our second to last row house and we did get the trees planted we did so the maple trees are in and we've got one family already in place 19 and 19 and they came over with 55. Okay. So we get this last corner row house done. Uh, you're clear back over here. Let's set you in this side of the, of, of the other houses just to get this area finished. Now, last time I talked about maybe another row house area up here with the church. I really don't know how to employ them. I'm kind of waffling on that idea there we've got the time we get these built in the last houses over there we're yeah and running the the three forestries and what have you we will have probably a fairly well balanced town jobs to people would probably be a little bit people heavy i don't know how i'm going to employ these guys other than just creating fake jobs you know, I'll do a bunch of mining until we just end up with a whole bunch of uh, of ore piled up that we can't do anything with. Or do a bunch more forestry. I don't know. We'll see. Don't. I'm not going to promise that we're going to develop this hill here. So, well, I'll kick it around. But this is quite the nice little community right here. It is. A lot of exclamation points, though. So what is up here? You... September. We didn't finish. That's what's going on. Okay. So September for you. I guess we'll... For some reason it didn't work. So let's go ahead and... Well, how best to do that? Oh, there's only one in each. That's what went wrong. These guys got changed. Okay. Yeah, there's supposed to be two in these and one in those. So, probably when I fired everybody a few episodes back. Something here didn't get uh, put back correctly. So, let's go through and do that. You are two of them in July and August only. Okay, so two. Although, this time I'm going to have to add September just to finish the job. And you are two of them for those two months. Whereas you guys are only one because it's such a small little thing okay so somebody will jump in here finish off what this is where it ends and unless the September fruit tree just automatically doesn't show fruit I guess we can tell by going over here 
Yeah, in September we go back to green trees. No fruit. So there is still fruit over here, but it doesn't uh, doesn't actually show it. So you are coming to work. Speed you up. So are you. There you are. And we should see that 2268 jumping up 28 at a time. Yeah, there we go. She's cleaning up the last of the trees. Okay. And the other worker, they both arrived. And we're done. Looks like we're done. Okay. So let's turn September back off. No exclamation point, and we're finished. Okay. So that fixes that. Next year that won't happen. Um, I didn't even check to see if Barvinkove took apples. That might have been a mistake. So you guys are fine. Um, well, they're back. <laughs> <laughs> they're back no apples okay so flower uh, September you may or may not get here by the time the boats arrive we may already have a frozen well we'll try it 800 so 800 of you and let's quickly put flower in 800 and do that. Okay, world map. Nothing else to sell you. Nothing else that I really want to buy. And Haroka, we're up to 2,000 now. That's an awfully strange number. Why 2,000 exactly? What are the odds? Right there. 610. I mean, we only have officially storage for 2,000. Is that what I'm getting here? You are right there, 4,000. No, by coincidence, it's exactly 2,000. All right, so September, rolling in October. I wanted to see if anything rolls in here. I think this is just for show, which means this becomes the new, uh, the new booze granary, booze storage. Yeah, there we go. This one, we should see a few things trigger. Over here, to give... A comparison we still have nothing so it doesn't happen instantly there's one item okay uh, there there honey swing over here to this one these should be fairly dramatic there's a whole bunch of things starting to roll in no nothing in this one yet over here we've got these starting to roll in bunch of apples over here all of these starting to come in look at the raspberries coming in and I don't think where was that th this one raspberries it probably wasn't a season there so that's next year you have some though and you have dried fruit so I'm guessing that the raspberries turn into dried fruit that would be my guess otherwise you would have had quite a few and they would have rolled into here uh, raspberry zero so I'm assuming that turns into dried fruit for a lot of them but over here we have some and you are quickly on your way to somewhere probably fruit this one no I didn't put fruit in there so that means you are are you going to here no anything to add no so you're going to here. No raspberries in this one. Interesting. Where do I have raspberries? Uh, this one. There's some, but no one's calling them. Huh. You are over here, though. Ah, uh, raspberries. These three? Yeah, there you are. Okay. So hopefully somebody over here is hungry for raspberries. I know I am. Hey, someone used the gazebo, and I put benches out and trees or bushes around, as well as in the corners. And one of these days we're going to get this well built. So, did do a little decorating, but a little out of time that I need to sit back and see how it looks when it's done. Um, well into October now, i got two, several things I want to check. Slow down, hops is finished. Okay. Waiting for a new season. So I'm going to say three was able to get it finished in August and September. So we'll do that. We'll do that. 
three at a time. Let's go to four. Just to make sure we don't almost finish correctly. So you guys are going home. We've got 1251 hops over here. Hops was to be stored in a shed near the brewery. That one. So that shed there. And apparently somebody's already brought some over. So 480 and so 16, 1700. So now we need to figure out what 1700 means. Brewery, let's hire up a couple of people. And barley in the system right now is 2300. Did you get brought over? No, barley will be at a granary. Okay, another messenger. Uh, barley there, there. So barley's over here. There's 700 over here already. More is on its way. Okay. So that's happening. So let's watch the brewery and see how that works. Everything's cleaned up here. And they were meant to be here just in case. No, they're, they're helping to thresh a lot of stuff. And this is going to be a lot of threshing. There's going to be a lot of grains over here. So we'll keep a crew here until when? Through October. And then a single person through the rest of the year to kind of clean up what got missed. And if that doesn't do it, then February ought to finish it. Okay, so I think that works out well. All right, so I wanted to check the hops. And I wanted to check this before it's hauled away. Was there a reason for you? Okay, beetroots, onions, and carrots came in here. All right, so pause. That's all that seemed to come in, unless I missed something else. Beetroots, onions, and carrots. Let's move those into here. So horseradish did. Peas would have. Let's say no to cabbage, no to cucumbers. Hmm. I guess peas. I don't know if peas have left already or not. But let's say beetroots, onions, and carrots. And I'm afraid if I do this, it didn't work. Okay. So beetroots, onions, carrots. Right there. And we're doing 1250s. Uh, we'll say kind of capacity we're looking at. We're in the twos. Okay, let's do 800. And buy them. And let's go ahead and put flour back down at the bottom just so I notice it separate from the rest. And 5,000. Alright, so with that, I'm going to cancel the rest of all this. Though I may end up putting some of it back in once we've taking care of our other needs but let's put in uh, beer let's put in mead let's put in Hiroka and let's put in 500 this stuff does not go bad to my knowledge though I, we've never had beer in here so that moves into here and she will remain assigned to go and get it whereas she We'll deal with this stuff. And you will be the one that stores these. So these can go away. You can take from other granaries. Now what's left over here? Buckwheat, wheat. So the wheat's over here. For these guys. Hmm... Let's do you here as well. Wheat. And 2,000. That's 500 per. Okay. So 2,000 wheat, 500 each of these. All the rest of it stays out over there where it's all being stored in our more of a central area. So wheat can go away as well. Buckwheat's kind of hanging around for the chickens just to put it, put it somewhere. So we've got one two, three chicken coops in this area. So that's as central as I can get. Salt is hanging around here because we make it right there. Um, how are we in salt? Salt, we're kind of low. 4,400. 
So we'll be selling salt again for a while. We've got four guys on, two guys off. I guess I can pull April out of there. Okay. All right, so in that case, you are now going to be the central storage for all of the boozes. So let's call you 5,000. 5,000, 5,000. All right, and you are take from other granaries. Don't know how that's going to work. What if I don't? You're the only one. So you don't need to say take from other granaries because it's not being stored anywhere else now. It's only here. So I think I, I think that works. You will take from just to pull enough over to keep this one going. Uh, this one going. Yeah. And that'll maintain your supplies right there. And you brought in 23 last month. And you didn't. Though you did grow. You went from 40 to 30. The thirty from thirty to forty-three. That's a surprise. Where'd the rest of that income come from? When it was, you know, one and two on the monthly. Hmm, huh, I don't know. We'll still build this one and see how it maintains. That might just not work there, but we'll come up with something else to line the side of that road and kind of. I wish I could think of something to go into here to. Once again, kind of build out this road here. They're just not... They stop there. That's interesting. I can't even imagine the answer to that question. <laughs> they come to here, and then it, it, there isn't enough traffic to continue? I mean, if, if it was solid here and thin there and thin there then it would make sense you've got a y and each one is taking half the traffic but this way it can only be the same i don't know what to make of that and you're cutting my corner yeah get off my grass <laughs> you i think i couldn't do anything with this because of the way that the uh, it interacts with the fences that uh, i think no, maybe not, because that's not the original fence. So let's grab a three rail. Yeah, I can go from there and let you through. I'll be kind, even though. And we'll take you to about there. Actually, we'll take you all the way to there. Curious to see how that works. Yeah, so what are you guys going to do now, huh? Yeah, I've changed your path. Whoops. Clip, clop. Snag the fence, snag the fence. Turn hard. Ah, uh, you're just going to have a hard time with that, aren't you? You are. Hmm. Oh, well. Give them time, see what they do. But yeah, they always head into the fence before they go back to center. They just do that. Give me a... You go from there out to there. Let's see. There, I already changed her direction. See if I can get these guys to start forming a path in the middle and leaving grass out of the fence lines like I want it to be. All right, you. Well, you could cut the corner, but otherwise you're heading to there. Me and my battle with Ostrov's road building system. Looks like you're going to hold true all the way through now. All right, two or three episodes from now, we'll find out if that worked. Okay, we're building a tavern. And then we're going to get this built before next year. And we'll do the same three on zero off pattern there. Start building more wells and gazebos. Speed things up? No, we need to see if you buy apples. You do. 13 days left. All right, so apples, we have 10,000 in the system. You'll buy 3,900. Deal. So give me, was it 3,907? Check that again. 39.70. Okay. Apples. I was going to put a bunch more, but that's the only one there that buys them. 39.70. So we'll do just what we need. Um, these folks will buy apples too. So let's just preload apples of 4,000. And too bad the pigs can't eat apples. That's not a thing, right? Because we do make lots of those. And they last for about a year. But 
it's not a thing. Hmm, okay. Alright, so anything else that you want from us? Sunflower oil. That's enough for us. Flour. Eh, well, we'll let that build up a little more. I think. Flour's over here. I'm running at one speed. Flour is not really over here. Flour is mostly over here now. Yeah. And are you already building up your supplies? You went and got some. Hopefully somebody else is going to go and get these. Okay. Um, laborers are available, so they'll help you if, 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 uh, if they get the urge to. You also want warm clothes. Well, we're doing pretty good there. Let's bring a thousand of you out. Deal. Warm clothes. And what? Sallow. We're in the 400s now. Okay. Is Sallow being brought out to here? It is not. Well, it's starting to. So 180. I'll have to check in on that, see what condition it's in. But I would imagine we're eating it as fast as we're making it. You onions. 3,800 in the system. Onions are not a thing that the pigs will do. Beetroots are all that I could do, right? And carrots. And I'm kind of wanting to keep the carrots for ourselves. Uh, here, carrots of 200. Let's do only 100. And cabbage of 100. I'd like to keep those in the... Um, yeah, right there. In the market stalls. As long as I can and get get those into houses keep the food variety we got plenty of potatoes for the pigs in fact maybe we should up that quantity so that they get brought over uh, in larger batches so potatoes we are right there at 400 let's go to well we'll go to 600 i was going to say 8 or 10 but they do rot so just in case all right so i'm still trying to finish this you or onions. Onions, let's bring over 1,000. And deal. And this is river trading, but no warnings here yet. 1,000 onions. Where is that graphic? There you are. Kind of a bright orange. And you're on your way. They're happening real slowly, but the river boats take a long time to get here, so no worries there. Carrots, maybe we got almost nothing. I think we're going to pull carrots completely out of the, the pigs. Apples, lime, beer. Over here to buy from you. Window glass we're making on our own. We got 1,700. I don't know what we had. Did we have only 1,000 of that before? I kind of think so. Mead. We aren't making yet, and we're down to quite a low number. Mead, 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 mead. We make beer and we make roca. We don't make mead. Ah, that's right. So let's bring in 2,000 mead. Deal. Bring that in. We're in the 15, 16,000 range up there. Salt, we're still low. Okay. And nothing is... Oh, there's nothing stored here. There's only salt stored there. So we've got 24 plus the, the 44. Okay. So you're done. And speed this back up. And where am I? In that 40-ish range. Okay. Um, oh, we're planting trees. Blump, blump, blump. What? Did you get employed? You got employed. <laughs> yeah, that's the one thing about having buildings you're not really using. They do tend to accidentally receive the orders from other buildings. Yeah, um... You're chopping trees now, too. Um... Let's cancel this whole thing. You weren't supposed to be here anyway. Yeah, when I set this one to five and three i thought well they're all gonna run that now so let's just do it five guys i'm hoping that they can bring enough logs in to keep the other ones working 
Anyway, so you guys, five logs, all you can maintain. Now that we're transporting firewood out of the forestries, it is really hard to maintain logs, except for this one. It's just got so much built up. But, yeah, it's, it's moving out quickly now. And autumn trees. Oh, they all just switched from golden brown to that color. November. So with November, the cows are not in yet. So once the cattle moves in, which is probably one of these guys right here. Boom, there she is. And off they go. Another one's going to happen over here. So there are no more cows. Yeah. Let's go ahead and set up our cows over here. Boats are coming in. Already? That must have been the previous one. Here's the ones we just ordered. Yeah, here they come. Oh, boy. <laughs> boy, there's a lot of map here. I would be until July trying to fill a town out across this whole map the rate that I go. Yeah. So, Mandalords gets going at the end of April. I'm kicking around going back into uh, Forever Skies in between, kind of finishing out that series. They've added a lot to the game, but it doesn't hit until the 28th of March. And I don't want to do it until uh, a couple days after that so they can get all their hot fixes in and, and uh, apologize for crashing everybody's game and finally fixing things and what have you. As usually happens when a major update comes out of any game. So run this one until a few days after the 28th. 26, whenever that is. We'll see. We'll see how this all times out. Um, what was I doing? Cows. That's what I was doing. All right. So let's slow this down and think about things. I want to transfer. And that's right. That is quite the ordeal. It's not like chickens. Grab 10 and go. No. Okay. Cows. And I don't think I can hold shift and choose a bunch. No. So I'm going to drag and drop one at a time. I want to do that. And luckily I can just do this till they turn blue. That turn blue? Feels like I don't have it now. Something moved. Ah, uh, okay. I'm going to pause completely. As soon as that one moved, the list moved and it canceled my order. Okay, so blue, two, three. There's four cows into that one. And a bull, but let's go for, well, we'll go for that bull. Right there. Now, over here, let's grab, hmm, a lot of bulls over here. There are. How are we in here? You could use a batch. You've got none saved up. And you slaughtering a pig and slaughtering a pig. All right, so let's set up three bulls to, uh, to take off all right there one two three you will be the bull for this one you are moving over there one two three and below that is what more bulls okay it's not a lot of cows over here let's set up three more for slaughter. Although when I do that we put a glut of beef onto the market and we may not finish it all. Okay. And so that's enough for this one to get this going. Yeah, we'll call that good. Um, how are we looking in regard to uh, beef? Beef perished. We do have some. Not a lot though. Historically we're, we're doing pretty good. We have a lot of people eating now. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, just the three cows at a time. Uh, pork. How are we on pork? Resources. Is it just called pork? It is. All right. That one a lot more. Okay. Sallow should be none. I think we eat through the, shop, the sallow real... Why did I not see it? There you are. Yeah. Perished. I don't think it's even a thing. We've imported a lot now we not doing any exporting but we yeah we've got nothing that we've lost so beef or pork 
I don't know what the quantities are. Are they equal? So, awaiting 88, sallow raw 88. So, one pig must make 88 or 44. They were both going after a pig. Hmm. I don't know. You are working these and firewood, and apparently we can't get enough firewood over here. Firewood was being stored there. We have 600, which is enough. They only grab 100 at a time. So you just need to be going to work. Then you will go get some firewood. Okay. You are doing beef, chicken, eggs, chicken, meat. Let's change the chicken, eggs, and chicken, meat is about to expire, to pork. One more chance to get it into people's homes. Clothes, warm clothes over here. Let's take salt and change you to clothes. Um, there you are. And let's change this clothes to, what's the other meat? Mutton. So this will be a meat vendor. Out here, an extension right off of the slaughterhouse there. Okay, so you will be doing all the meats, you will be doing all of the clothing and, and all the warmth. And yeah, okay. So that's that. We are in November. You are being built. Okay. Farm is completely cleared. Cleared. Um, did I say use a fallow field? No. So you're going to do that. No livestock has made it here yet. Okay. You're going to do a fallow field. And you... Let's do it this way. Farm. Boom, boom, boom. And boom. So you are fallow. Okay. So when we get to the barley again, we're going to be... We're going to have a really bad barley run. Because it was out of sync and it's not going to have its nutri nutrients. But... That's just how it's going to be. Okay. Um, what else needs to be supervised and min-maxed? <laughs> I'll work on these maybe after the episode. See if I can coordinate either five or six. I'm not sure what I want to do there. Or two sets of three or something like that. Um, how do we do here this time? 14 and 16. And none left so we still ran out of wool okay so we'll probably take one more month out of it or start them oh well, we're starting in april let's pull one more month out actually let's go back to work let's leave august available uh tavern is done and a new family settling into town ah okay um what do we want here i want to turn august off and September on. If I got that correct, yeah. Apply to all just to be sure. And no, there aren't any other fulling mills for me to mess that up. So you are already coming in. We have another tavern. Do I evict you? Sorry, dudes. I was thinking I was just going to move you over. So if I ask you to just move to a new location, that is no longer really a thing. Well, you're still doing pretty good there. You're coming in with 141 wealth. Okay. So, you used to run a tavern like this in another town where you were you were doing you were sitting just fine. All right, so what's happened over here? You now have two of the boozes. We don't have any beer yet. We need to go check on that, though. And these are eventually going to go away. Is it time to transfer goods? We got our bridge in. Is it time to make this real? Don't know. I was I going to check? Beer. How are you guys doing? Slow down and think about things. One batch is in. 500. So, okay, of 500 hops, 500 barley, char 500 charcoal, 500 water. <laughs> okay, 
So you've got 500 sitting there, so the well can handle one batch. This over here is probably what they drained last time. Otherwise, how are the wells doing over here? You... Hmm... We're making it much faster than we can use it. So I think we're going to take you down to two batches. And we can sell beer if I remember right. You have got 200 water left over there. We have water right here. You've got a thousand. Okay. We're going to want water probably over here and next to this guy. Kind of makes sense. So, and you are right there so you can grab from it as well. So, behind or along the side? I don't know what happens here. Yeah, I think it would look good right in this area. Let's grab one of these kind of wells and sit you alongside the building so you're up in here okay you are that one you can move into this area as well these guys can build wells pretty quick speed things back up no traders to worry about well it's looking good just noticing no it isn't I was no workers to load trade boat. I was noticing that this bridge felt a lot longer, and I realized, no, they're actually just using it. Yeah, there's no pathway here. There's no... Now yeah, we're getting to... We're starting to grow a pathway there. This one's got a real pathway. So, are you still... You... How did that happen? Oh they all came in late we're clear in December okay let's get you going and throw in a fourth one the boats are finally arriving okay get to work get to work get to work get to work how far you gotta go you a row house you were just happened to be walking by great all right boats don't give up we're gonna freeze you in place before long all right you're the top one yeah you're grabbing apples did we bring everything over um, I'm thinking that we did. There's a bunch of apples leaving. Um, of 3970, that's right. Okay. And you're out of here. Here's another apple boat coming in. No, that was a that was an, an onion boat. All right, more meat is being delivered. And you're being unloaded. I'm waiting for the other apple boat to get here. So it would have come uh, maybe 2001, and you're going to grab the rest? There you go. We made it. Take you guys back down. Two would almost do it, but there was one time we were running two, and, and they were all had just started their break at the same time, so I went for three. A little better chance of, uh, of them... Uh, of one of the three being available. Let's slow down and think about Balakli. I've got 4,000 apples preloaded into here. Uh, you are right there and you don't do apples. Okay, so that didn't help. Um, yeah, so cows, iron, horse, charcoal, nails, stone. Stone, we're at 57. It's 1,000 per base of row houses. And then pathing. Pathing. That's part of the... Let's buy it. Part of the decorating. It's going to be putting stone pathing in. So, yeah. Let's bring a big load of stone in just for that. Uh, no stone is sitting in here. So we're not plugging the place up for, with that. Alright, so that's it for buying. What do we want to sell to you? Flour is coming in hard and fast right now. Um, we have a lot more wheat. We're not going to make Harelka that fast. So the distillery doesn't have to consume that much. In fact, we're probably going to have more wheat than we know what to do with for a while. So let's do a whole 2,000 flour. And you're over here. What was that last? I saw it, but I didn't see it. The hop yard. Okay. Flour, 2,000? I think is what I said. Temporary you and map potatoes we're keeping 
until the last second. Dried fish were at 2,500. Nice. Let's sell. And eh, let's sell 1,500 of that. Deal. Fish. Dried. D. 1,500. And stone well is in. All right, dry fish sunflower oil. Let's sell off 1,000 of that as well. Deal. I think it's, we only have one more sale to do. So what's the best one? Balaclia. You are salt, right? We're not selling that. No, you weren't salt. So you just miscellaneous stuff. Clothing. No, textile, leather. Where are we on leather? We need to buy leather. Uh, metal parts, although leather is stored too. Metal parts, you want to buy from us. Horse stack and honey. Honey, let's sell you 1,000. That'll finish this deal. Alright, so honey. Uh, right there. And temporary stock you. Okay. Now, Balaclia is fairly close. So we need to get this stuff moved. We're into December. Don't know what we're really doing out there as far as laborers go. What's the charcoal looking like? Charcoal has dropped to 4,000. Wow. Okay. Though... That doesn't count what's already in here. There's 3,000 there. And in here... There's 1,400, and here there's 800, so I think we're going to be okay for a while. Um, would really like to see this row fill up, and it's not happening. So, okay, one just happened, two. Okay, something, something happened in town. And it's possible that the... Well, by wagon. Let's get that triggered. So, by wagon can happen. Ah, this one probably should do that as well. Yeah. One thing we're not doing is labor by hand. Which hurts us in a way, because there's a bunch of ladies that could be jumping in and helping when we're desperate. Uh, another stone well is done, and the hops came in. So let's transfer your orders across. So you should be four people coming in in March, planting it up. And then here through half of August and the rest of September taking it all down. Okay. Do we have any actual beer production yet? What was the timing on that? We are fermenting. Alright, so we have a fermenting process, gathering materials. You're having a hard time. Well, that makes 500, so you're almost there. Charcoal. Yeah, a lot of charcoal is being used. But we should be filling these guys up. Just looking for faces there. There's a whole bunch of faces there. Wow, that's where they all are. They all want to fill that one. Over here, anything happening? One. So, it is happening here and there. Okay, you're still over here. They really like to raid this place. Uh, firewood. 5,000 firewood? No, 3,800 is leaving. 3,800 is kind of an odd number. I would think 3,000. So maybe there's an 800 leaving somewhere else too. But we're bringing it back to here. So you... There's a 100 heading into there. You... There's the 3,400 of it. Okay. So it's happening. And they're going to... Yeah, they're going to start filling this all up again pretty soon. There's eight to 9,000 per mound. So just like that, we'll have another 25, 30,000 charcoal in the system. So it, it's happening. All right, so I need to know that this is happening. Hmm. Awaiting 1,100, awaiting 1,000, awaiting 1,140, and awaiting 600. It's happening. It's just not as instantaneous as I would like. So it would be nice to get a trail blazed right into town here. That would be fun. Probably not going to happen though. So where are we? We're in that one hour range. I think we're at the end of this episode already. Wow. Um, 
Next time we'll see both of these plant up. Um, you fermenting, fermenting. Hops are dried, barley is germinated, malted, and the result is boiled, called mashing, and the end result is fermented for one month. So you're actually pretty close. Next episode, we'll see our first batch of beer. Yep, and you guys have got some booze in here, and you're up and running. Month, look at that, previous month's income, 780, 240. Yeah, the problem is here. So once we get another row house or, or one of these other places up and built, we'll transfer these folks out and tear this tavern down. It's not viable there, but over here it seems to be working just fine. So it is a distance from house issue. Okay, so with that, let's call this one done. Thanks for watching, folks, and I'll catch you next time. Bye now.